former US President Donald Trump has survived yet another assassination attempt, his second in just two months. This time, it happened on 15th September at his golf course in West Palm Beach, Florida. At around 1.30 p.m. local time, Secret Service agents spotted a man armed with an AK-47 style rifle lurking near the course boundary. The agents immediately opened fire after noticing the suspect hiding in the bushes. The gunman, later identified as 58-year-old Ryan Wesley Routh, fled the scene in a black vehicle but didn't get far. He was tracked down and arrested shortly after. Trump's campaign communications director Stephen Chung quickly reassured everyone, the former president is safe. This is the second attempt on Trump's life in just a few months. On 13th July, Trump narrowly dodged death when a bullet cased his ear during a rally in Butler, Pennsylvania. After the Florida shooting, Trump directly addressed his supporters saying, and I quote, There were gunshots in my vicinity. But before rumors start spiraling out of control, I wanted you to hear this first. I am safe and well. Nothing will slow me down. I will never surrender. Following the gunfire, Trump campaign headquarters located within the same complex as the golf course went into lockdown. So who is Ryan Wesley Routh, the man behind this attack? Routh, a 58-year-old former construction worker from Greensboro, North Carolina, has no military background. But he has previously expressed a desire to fight in armed conflicts, including in Ukraine during Russia's 2022 invasion. Routh has a history of erratic behavior and multiple run-ins with the law. Back in 2002, he was involved in a standoff with police armed with a fully automatic weapon. His son describes him as someone who hates Donald Trump like all reasonable people, but claims he didn't think his father even owned any firearms. The FBI and Secret Service are now deep into investigating this latest attempt on Trump's life. A high-powered rifle, complete with a scope and a GoPro camera, was recovered from the scene. The investigation is still ongoing and authorities have yet to reveal what motivated Routh or how he planned this attack. Stay tuned for more updates on this developing story.